What's up guys, Spin Firearms here and today we're going to be talking about holster options from Hog Holsters. Now, if you saw my previous video, this is their pocket holster called the Stash Holster. Absolutely love it. This is for my Glock 42. And this piece you see right here that would be up against your body, it wouldn't be protruding from your pocket, is simply a push-off tab. And man, does that thing work. And I absolutely love that pocket holster. But before we get started on the actual holster we're going to talk about, Please hit the like button, drop a comment down below, tell me what you carry in, what kind of rounds you carried with, hit the subscribe button guys, help the channel out, it would mean a lot to me. But like I said, this is from Hog Holsters, and one thing I absolutely love about them is, read their saying, helping America wear guns. And that's true, that's what they're here for. They're an American company, veteran owned, um, somebody who does this for a living, and he handcrafts these each individually himself. So I absolutely love that. But anyways, I was curious about a Mossberg MC2 SC holster because there wasn't the most selection in the world. And I've had hog holsters in the past for my FN503, my Ruger SR9C, and I love them. One of the number one things I like about them is the size of the Kydex. He uses it as thin as possible, but still to where it's solid, it's strong, but at the same time it does has a little flex to it. And I sort of like that. Some holsters have no flex to it. It can't shape to the contour of your body unless it's a hybrid holster. Now, I'm about 50-50 on hybrid holsters. I don't mind them. Um, I do carry with them occasionally. But in a situation like this, it's the best of both worlds. Now, like I said, for my Mossberg MC2 SC. has great retention. And, of course, they are using my favorite clip, the Alta Clip 3, I believe, Plus. I want to say it is. All I know, it's the wider version. This is how you carry in gym shorts, sweatpants, snow pants, a bathing suit, khakis, dress pants, li literally anything. And all you do is unclip, slide whatever under there, especially like if you have gym shorts or sweatpants. Make sure that string, you have your pants and your gym shorts as tight as possible first. And then slip it underneath there and boom, you're good to go. That's going nowhere. But what I really, when I first got this, I was like, what the heck? What is this? I've never had that on a holster before. But then I put it on, and I'm like, once I get my, my um, what do you call, optic on here, that is absolutely perfect. How many times have you been shooting in the summer, for instance, I went out to some property with 40 acres, shooting my Glock 26 with an optic, and when I go to draw, I'd have a little bit of fog or like um, just residue from moisture from it being 90 degrees while I'm shooting. So this definitely protects, it's basically a sweat guard for your optic. Obviously, you have sweat guards and stuff like this to protect the sweat from your firearm like a normal holster does but genius put it right there to protect your optic on top of that it bends and folds to your body but it's still a very very strong kydex i absolutely love this thing very easy to draw and the number one thing i like about hog holsters is they have a lot of uh, holster options for firearms that other holster companies don't offer so that's always a plus always a go-to um, they give you the tools you need to adjust this if you want to adjust it but it's just an absolutely really well-made um, holster. I love it. This is just a black carbon fiber. I thought it looked perfect with my Mossberg MC2 SC. And yeah, absolutely love this holster. Also really enjoying the pocket stash holster because both of these combined, literally, that's what I tell everyone. Get a pocket pistol, get a main carry, and you're good to go. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed that. Those hog holsters, you, you can use code SPN for 10% off every time on any amount of holsters. Thanks for watching, guys.